this thing, holy cow. This R2 kit is amazing. So I, I'm no stranger to like all the lines and I, I love them all, but this has got something, this has got a little extra, it's like it's got some extra special sauce on it, you know what I mean? It's like, I like the addition of the hoops. Um, so my 57s have the straight die cast hoops, they're really heavy. And while it helps them sing, I, I, I think having these 302s are allowing these to open up a little bit more, get a little bit more resonance and singing out of the toms, which I really dig. Now, the Gretsch has always been around in Nashville. And it's really good to see Gretsch have a more uh, pronounced visual presence as well. So the guys are touring with them. These things are, you know, great for touring. I've, I've put mine through rigorous testing on the road and they keep coming back for more. I mean, I've, I've yet to have any major problems out of <laughs> Gretsch drums touring. So this knock front finish has a real real vintage vibe to it, you know, it reminds me, I'm a big Ringo fan, huge Ringo Starr fan. And so this finish reminds me of Ringo's kit. You send this out on the road right now and people be happy with it, you know, the whole tour. Never have a problem out of it. Sonically, sounds amazing. Playing wise, it feels amazing. The Nitron finish, you know, it looks incredible. I mean, why wouldn't you want this drum kit on the road? <laughs>